This myth originated in the Big Apple, atop an architectural icon, the Empire State Building. The myth is that if you throw a penny off of a building this height, that it'll either get going so fast that it'll embed itself in the concrete on the, at the base of the building, or it'll hit somebody in the head and kill them. Adam and Jamie need to find out what is a penny's maximum speed when falling. In other words, its terminal velocity. Once they've done that, they'll shoot the coin at concrete, asphalt, and a head made from ballistics gel. It's time to see if Jamie's penny can achieve terminal velocity. Okay, the modified staple gun blasts the coin from three feet at the concrete block. Look, you can see the penny imprint. The penny traveled the three feet in 16 five hundredths of a second. The rig has shown that we can fire this penny at about 65 miles an hour, which is at the upper level of what studies have shown that, that the terminal velocity of a penny would be. So the test shows that a coin traveling at terminal velocity cannot penetrate concrete or asphalt. But what about flesh and bone? Remember, the penny myth talks about a penny shattering someone's skull. Enter Norma, Adam's ballistics dummy. Norma's cranium will take the full brunt of a penny traveling at terminal velocity. Lights. Perfect hit. Lights off. Yep. The penny broke through the thin layer of ballistics gel, but the skull is intact. So, you ready to put that to the ultimate test? We've tried it on all the other stuff we've got. Want to try and catch it in your hand? The penny is leaving an imprint in the concrete when it hits, so, uh, you know, I'm a little hesitant about catching it, actually. The Mythbusters are about to find out what happens when a penny traveling at 64 miles per hour hits skin. I'll do it. Okay. But you got to do it too, otherwise, you know, you're like a wuss. Okay, you first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Still a wuss. I'll kick your Penny for your thoughts right about now, Adam. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. Three, two, one. Ow! <laughs> Uh, that didn't actually hurt that much. Well, Jamie, take cover, because Adam's taking aim. All right. Firing in three, two, one. Well, that seemed to work like a charm. <laughs> Look at that imprint. You can clearly see where it hit. The penny is shot from the slot at almost three times the speed of sound. Uh, the high-speed camera result apparently is 3,000 feet per second. Well, that's that's like a bullet. That's <laughs> the speed of a bullet. The coin still did not end up embedded in the block. 64 miles an hour just wasn't enough to cause any kind of damage to a person. And then when we made it go almost three times the speed of sound, it still wasn't enough to break the bones. Yeah, I mean, the worst thing I can come up with is if you were looking straight up in the sky and you got hit in the eye, it probably wouldn't be very good for you. But even then, I don't know whether it'd take your eye out. <laughs> I think we busted the heck out of this one. Myth busted? Yeah. <laughs>